Dr. Amano and we're going to do a problem on electrochemistry. Hey, Dr. Amano, I like your shirt. That element, samarium, you must really like that element. I love every element, just the way a mother loves children. So why don't we come around and forget my shirt and let's do an electrochemistry question. What I want to do in this problem is an electrochemistry question, but here's the deal. You can use a calculator for this. The numbers on the dot would be a little bit nicer and even in the destroyer nicer. So for this one, use a calculator. All I really care about you understanding the material. It says consider the following electrolysis of a salt. And what we're gonna do, the salt has the general formula XNO33. It takes 100 seconds for a current of 1.5 amps to plate 0.108 grams of the metal from a solution of this salt. I want to identify the metal. Is it aluminum? Is it indium? Is it bismuth? Is it chromium or copper? I give you the Faraday's constant. It's 96,500 coulombs per mole. So that's provided on the data exam. The first move I do is I take the salt and I break it down into X plus 3 and 3 nitrates. Obviously, if there's three nitrates, there's a minus three, so this must be a plus three, and you need three electrons to take this reduction from a plus three to the solid metal X. Where do I begin? The first formula you would use is what I call the I quit formula, which says that I equals Q, let me make that a little nicer T, I equals Q over T. I is for amps, Q is for charge, and T is for the time in seconds. Let's plug in some numbers. Current is 1.5, we don't know Q, the time is 100 seconds, and that gives me 150 coulombs of charge. I'm gonna take that 150 coulomb of charge and watch what I do. We know that one mole of electrons is 96,500 coulombs. So that's also that Faraday constant. So one mole of electrons is 96,500 coulombs, cancels out. One mole of this compound X requires three moles of electrons, and that crosses out electrons. So when I take 150 divided by 96,500 over three, on the actual dead, you would just round this to, to 100,000. So this would be 150 over 300,000. If you want to work that out quickly, you will get an answer pretty close to 5.18 to the minus fourth moles. Now what? The atomic weight is equal to the grams over the moles. The molecular weight of something also equals grams over moles. But since we're talking an individual species, we say atomic weight. The number of grams was 0.108. The moles we just worked so hard to get, and that gives me 208. So what I'm gonna do is I go to the periodic table and I see which one of these elements is closest to 208. I'm looking at a periodic table now and bismuth is 209, which is almost exactly on top of it. So the correct answer is bismuth. So this compound would be a bismuth, bismuth 3 nitrate. Okay, that wraps this up, I hope this helps. Go to the Dat Destroyer, you'll see a few more questions on electrolysis, and you'll be set for the Dat. All right, that's it. Bye-bye.